before black lives can matter, they first have to matter to black people. I want you to look at this video of this, so, this father and what he did. To the seven-year-old girl who had to watch me and my brothers jump her daddy out the school, I'm sorry. I know that was probably a traumatizing experience for you. But we kept asking you to stop bullying my daughter and you wouldn't listen. We sent letters home. We even had a meeting with you and your parents and you wouldn't listen. So now you know your actions have consequences. And since you're too young to receive those consequences, you had to watch your daddy take those consequences. Get some therapy. You'll be all right. We have black on black murder black on black crime because of idiots like this he really think this is cool he needs to be put in prison and locked away no you don't do nothing like this that's why you have the sheriff department you have the police department you and you also have lawyers where you can sue the school for allowing his daughter to be abused because this isn't bullying this is abuse the school allowed his daughter to be abused by another child and so he has a right to sue that school. But black folk don't think that way. Black folk always got the, yo, how can I show I'm the toughest in the world? We're about to have a black on black murder and another black man in prison for life. Because the black man whom his brothers beat up, he's going to come back. And he's going to get, if it's a white boy, oh, he's going to die. Oh, the white boy is going to come back. Boom. But what, whoever this is, this man is going to come back. He's going to come back guns a-blazing. And you know what's going to happen? You're going to have another black man dead and another black man in prison. I hope they lock him up. Just give an example to his daughter that got bullied. This is how you handle situations like this. Then I hope the man, once he get locked up, get a lawyer, then sue the school because he took matters in his own hands and him and the other father that got um, beat up, I hope they put their minds together. So since, you know, we had to do this and this violence is because you failed to do your actions, school. He beat me up, so you're about to pay my medical bills and I'm suing you and I'm about to sue you because I got locked up because I beat him up and me and my brothers getting locked up. So now y'all responsible. And I hope and pray it's a white district attorney and a white judge. No black judge, no black district attorney because black folk don't understand. I saw the comments, cause it's, it was on that racist Jameel Hills um, thing on Instagram, that racist Jameel Hill. And people, and she justifying it. You know what get more black men killed each year? Black women. Black women ignorance get black men killed by, because of the games they play. This black man, it, 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 Two months from now, you're going to hear him being shot and killed. You're going to hear that. Or it's going to be a something's going to happen to his daughter. Because if I saw your daddy beat up my daddy and I'm already bullying you, oh, I'm coming back to school the next day and I'm going to hurt you. I'm going to physically hurt you. Lock a slam into it's going to be some physical. So now the violence, the cycle of violence never ends in the black community because the black community don't want it. This video right here is an example. And if you want to know what Jamal, why got to be a white judge and a white uh, 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 prosecutor or Asian judge or Asian prosecutor or Latino judge or Latino prosecutor, because what we saw in Baltimore, Maryland with Marilyn Mosley, you had a black female judge say, you embezzled money, lock innocent people up, but I'm not gonna lock you up because you got daughters. That's, if you commit a crime, you go to jail. But oh, black privilege, white privilege is here. So nobody black better not be saying there's no such thing as black privilege because a black female judge let this black woman go all because she's a black woman with kids. Isn't that racist?